Now, again, keep in mind, I tend to buy things that I don't need. I am an Amazon addict. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Natalie. Today I have for you an Amazon favorites video. It's been such a long time. I actually asked you guys on Instagram what you wanted to see and many of you requested this video. I filmed a few of these videos and they're honestly also one of my favorites to watch, which I'll be listing my other ones down below for you guys. But if you know me, then you know that I am obsessed with Amazon. I am an Amazon addict. I probably buy something from there every single day and more than half of the things in my apartment are from Amazon. So today's video is going to be focused on mostly like apartment things and finds that I've gotten for my apartment. So yeah, this may or may not be a long video. So grab something to drink and let's jump right into it. I already know this video is going to be all over the place, just random categories. So starting with my top favorite find an item. For my apartment, it has to be my key holder. I am genuinely obsessed with this item. It's a magnetic cloud. It's white. You just stick it on your wall and it's super affordable. I think it's like $8 or seven. I used to constantly lose my keys either in my coat pockets or my purse or just around the apartment. And now it's just super easy and right next to my door. I literally just pass my hand around it and it just grabs it. So I love it. It's my favorite purchase of my apartment and it works. After I moved and I started organizing things, my best friend asked me to make an organizing kitchen video. So if you're interested, let me know and I'll definitely make it soon for you guys, like some hacks or just the way that I organize my cabinets and also the pantry, which I actually just use it for storage. That being said, my next favorite, it's an organizing favorite and it's a broom holder. This has been a lifesaver for me because I am the type that I hate clutter in a way especially the clutter that brooms and mops make to me it's just really not pleasing and since i live in a studio i need it somewhere to put it but also hide it at the same time <sighs> this meal i first got the five holder one which didn't fit in my door so i ended up giving it to my mom and then i ended up getting the three holder one i keep my mop broom and swiffer or swifter in there and it also has some hooks so you could either hang towels or umbrella like i do long story short it's just really practical and great for organizing and it's only 13 a water filter was one of my first purchases for my apartment because i obviously needed a water filter and i didn't want to constantly purchase water when new york city water is just pretty good to be honest with you so i ended up getting this one which is a max one from brita and it has a knob or a dispenser so your water could come out like many of you guys know white is one of my favorite colors so i obviously like getting probably everything white in my apartment that i can and my fridge is black so i thought it was a good idea to get a black brita which at the end of the day i guess it is but inside of my fridge everything is white and i didn't think that through you know what i mean like i just thought everything inside was black I don't know where my head was at because I've never seen a black fridge inside. Long story short, I got the black one. It's honestly one of my biggest pet peeves because I truly wish I got the white one. It's too late right now. I had a really hard time trying to find the perfect laundry car or somewhere to put my laundry. And this one has to be the perfect find from Amazon. It's a rolling laundry car. Honestly, lifesaver, especially because I have a laundry in my building. So I just have to like roll it downstairs and then I'm good whenever I need to do laundry. And it also has a little string thing to close it, which is great. And some handles as well. I ended up getting it in a size large. They also have a smaller one and a three one, which is great if you want to divide your laundry by color but it's really useful and it's amazing especially for me so in my apartment there was a door that every single time i would open it it would kind of hit the wall really hard and i was fearing to make a hole so i decided to get a hole holder a wall protector which is just basically a circle sticker that you just put it in the area that the knob touches the wall if you i don't i don't know if that makes any sense i'm sure you guys know what i'm talking about i'm just not making any sense but it was really affordable and helped my wall a lot when i lived with my mom i had a huge clothing rack which i absolutely love it was from ikea only 13 dollars and it was a really great size like it was pretty big you could fit a lot and it also had the bottom shelf thing where you could put your shoes if you want to but when i moved to this apartment it being a studio i I mean, there were like some places that I could put it, but to be honest with you, I only use my clothing rack for new items and for fashion hauls. 
so I don't technically need it need it. That being said, I ended up getting rid of my Ikea one, which again, it's a really great one and it's a lot more affordable than this one. But I needed a smaller one that would fit really nicely and this one also has a lot of storage. It has two different shelves and I got it for my housewarming, so thank you so much, Caroline. I absolutely love it and it works perfect in my little closet area. Like I mentioned, I absolutely love white and I love, more than anything, white sheets. So I got some white sheets from Amazon, which I love. They're amazing, amazing quality and pretty affordable. And I also have a filler for my comforter, which I'll list down below as well for you guys. Super random, but actually really useful. It's the O-Seater. My boyfriend used to see me all the time mop by hand. And he was like, why don't you have one of those machines that just drain the water for you so i was like you know what another amazon thing that i could get so i ended up falling for it and got this one absolutely love it it's a pretty big size not gonna lie so it occupies more space than the one that i had before but it's a lifesaver because it literally just drains the water you put the water in here and then put the mop in here and just step on this and it drains the water for you. So it brought this and the actual mop, which you can get different heads for the mop later on. And I love it. So my last desk went through Helen back and I needed something to cover it or protect it because the one that I got is from Target and I know that their wood isn't the best. The one that I had previous to that one was also from Target and it would always get stained either with makeup or ruined with nail polish remover. Yes, I'm that person. I used to not take care of my desk. Long story short, I told myself that I wasn't going to do that with this new desk that I got. So I ended up getting a protector. It's a thick plastic desk cover. I ended up getting the perfect measurement for my desk. I took the measurements from Target's website to then get the perfect measurement for the actual plastic. I originally wanted to get the glass top, but to be honest with you, it costs way more than the actual desk. So I was like, absolutely not, and got this one, and it was like $20, I think. Pretty useful. At first, it took some time to actually lay completely down flat. And sometimes if there's something that pressures it really hard, it gets like darker in certain areas, but you just have to like put it up and then down again, if that makes sense. I'm just OCD with certain things like that, so that bothers me but I fix it all the time. Point is it works and if you're clumsy as me or if you have kids and want to take care of your fake wood or actual real wood you can definitely get that. Moving on with some cleaning slippers. Another one that wasn't necessarily a need it was just I saw it in the site and I was like you know what maybe one day I'll need this and I got it. It's cleaning slippers. It has the little fuzzy things. I've mentioned endlessly how my apartment collects so much dust. This is basically quite perfect for it because as I'm walking, I'm cleaning my floor. And you can just take this out, wash it individually, and it's a teddy bear. So it's a win-win situation here. They come in different colors or animals and it's just really cute. Basically. Talking about dust, this has to be my favorite purchase hands down from absolutely everything, not just Amazon, but purchase that I'm like, I didn't know I needed it and it has saved my life. Maybe it sounds a little dramatic, but honestly, when I started seeing these things, I'm like, there's no way that that's actually useful. Like, why are people so lazy and why can't they just broom or vacuum by hand? So this is a robot vacuum and if you know me, I am all about saving. So I wasn't going to pay for the iRobot, especially if this works just as good. I personally feel that sometimes many things are more money just because of the name brand. This one is D-Box and it works amazing. It also can connect to your phone so you can turn it on and turn it off through your phone. I haven't done that yet, but it has like the Alexa situation. But yeah, this collects dust. This also cleans my rug really nicely and it goes on top of my rug. It does say in the description that it needs to be a thin rug, so just keep that in mind because it gets stuck in my fuzzy rugs that I have next to my bed. So that's what it looks like. You turn it on right here. It has a little house, you could say, and then it goes straight back to the house from the remote if you want to. The bottom looks like this, it has like the bristles here, then the actual like sucking thing. <laughs> I'm so bad describing this. It also has a little camera here that lets it know not to like fall if you have stairs or not to cross or run over certain things. And then to get out the dust or clean it, you just do that. I don't know if I want to technically show you guys my disgustingness. That's what it looks like. I'm not gonna open it for you guys. Long story short, yes, it's useful and it works and it's amazing. On to things that I told myself, Natalie, you don't need it. 
but you should get it are these right here this one is to organize your cabinets you literally just either drill it or hang it from your cabinet door and put either detergents or plastic bags aluminum foil anything you have in mind I haven't hung mine yet because it doesn't fit in my door. So I'm trying to figure out if I can make it work anywhere else. If not, I'll have to return it. But it is useful. Just make sure to measure your doors. Not like me. This is something that I was completely shocked in finding out that it exists. And it's actually really, really useful. It's to put or store toilet paper in here. You just put it or hang it from your actual toilet. You basically hang it from the top of your toilet cover and close it with the top and then you just put some toilet paper in here and just have some backup in case people don't have toilet paper when they go to the bathroom. This was also a thing that was kind of sort of a fail for me and I was so sad about it because I really needed a storage for my toilet paper. But the way my toilet is set up, it doesn't fit because it's way too close to the wall so I can't put it from the other side and then on this side it's where the flushy thing is at. So story of my life but if you have a practical toilet definitely get this it's a lifesaver more things that i didn't need but later on i found out that i actually needed it you're probably wondering natalie what are these plastic things well since you asked these are cleaning scrapers again it's a thing that you're like i definitely don't need it and then you're like oh my god how have I lived without it? You can clean or scrape out those really hard to clean pots that gets food stuck in the pan. You literally just scrape it off and it comes out right away. This also recently helped me getting rid of a sticker that was stuck somewhere and it took it out completely. And it's also great to clean your walls, your floors, your windows, or your counters with this. If there's anything stuck, you just basically scrape it right off and it comes out. I'm telling you guys, get it and you're gonna thank me later. It's super affordable as well. More kitchen things because I'm a housewife now without being a wife. This is a sink caddy. I really wanted something to hold my sponges but also got stuck to the sink. And every single time I would get one from either Bed Bath & Beyond or Marshalls, they would always just come right out. So I ended up getting this one. It is amazing. It's the best one I've ever gotten or used. It literally just hangs from the actual sink and then it comes with the two sucky things and you stick it right into the sink so it holds two and then there's another one that's a little bit bigger of a size and you could also put your soap in there as well now personally i like my coffee black so this is basically a purchase that i didn't technically need but i was mind blown so i was like i'm gonna get it one day someone's gonna come in my house and they're gonna want a cappuccino or a foamy coffee or hot chocolate and this is gonna save my life when that person comes so it basically just creates foam and you can make cappuccinos with this it's super practical and it was really affordable you just need one battery in there and it instantly works so yeah that's what it looks like and it also brings a little container situation so it stands pretty something that i recently showed in my channel was how i stored my christmas tree and it's a christmas tree storage bag i got it from amazon which i'll also list down below for you guys but if you want to see it in action go and check out my latest video on it curtain holder this right here is amazing i ended up dividing my room with some curtains so i got these curtain holders just in case i want to hold it like this one right over here and you basically just wrap it around and it's magnetic so pretty useful pretty easy to use and it's a pretty color it's like a beige color this one came with two but they do have another pack that comes with four i believe but two was more than enough for me now these two are my latest purchases i got jewelry holders these are stick-on or adhesive so you can just stick it right onto your wall or anywhere that you would like to stick it to i'm planning on putting these in my shoe shelves or the walls of the outer part of my shoe shelves so i can display my necklaces in there and it comes in a pack of four it was again really affordable it's white i love it you don't have to do anything crazy with it because it's adhesive so lifesaver now again keep in mind i tend to buy things that i don't need but my best friend ended up getting me a bar cart do i drink not really but it's pretty it's gold and it's from amazon that's what it looks like it goes perfectly with the apartment furniture it's super cute it's gold and it's pretty empty so i still need to stock it up but again i don't drink so that being said natalie why do you need some liquor dispenser or holders 
I just thought it would look super cute on the actual bar cart. So I got it. These are meant to put in whiskey or wine. I genuinely just thought they look super cute. So I got it. It was only $20. I got the rectangular shape one and the diamond triangle shape one. Super cute. Perfect for winter is this soft and cozy flannel blanket that I ended up getting for my friends for the holidays. I got it in a size queen and in the color white, of course, and I love it so much. It comes in different colors, so make sure to check it out. It's only $20. Now, very last but not least, which I am sure is one of your most requests because honestly, every single time I have featured it on my Instagram stories, you guys are constantly asking me to send you the link. I'm going to be listing them in my actual Amazon account, so go and click on there, follow it if you want to, and it's going to have a bunch of other favorites of mine from Amazon if you want to shop my cart. I've gotten my couch, my coffee table, my actual dining table, and also a little bistro set for my balcony from Amazon. So yeah, again, I'm an Amazon addict. What can I say? Anyways, I hope you guys liked this video, found some new items to shop and spend your money on. I'm sorry. If you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up and also make sure to follow my actual Amazon account so you can stay tuned with all my Amazon purchases and favorites. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time. But your brooms, your mop. So this is not necessarily useful. And it was, it was a purchase that I didn't technically need. You want to know a fun fact? I had to go and knock on my neighbor's door because they play loud ass typico at one o'clock, probably every single day. And you just hear it like booming. And now the freaking ambulances keep crossing by. I'm nits for my kitchen. Wow, that happened. <laughs> okay, so. All right, the bun is a little different, but we're just gonna keep going. Alrighty. Two extra randomness that I was like, Natalie, you definitely don't need it but you should get it. I probably buy something from Amazon every day and it's gotten to a point where it's like, Natalie, take a chill pill.